Hi everybody, it's Barty Joyce here, back again with another vlog. This is part of my November 30 day challenge. And today I'm going to talk to you about the lighting in, obviously, videos, YouTube videos that you do. Well, the best, it's best to try and get natural lighting if you can. So, by if you buy a window like what I am now, it's nice to get like the natural lighting down, down like your face and that, so, so it's not all, so it's not so... It's not, it's not dark or bright, not too bright, not too dark. You can spend a lot of money on lighting, but you don't have to do that to start off with because it's quite expensive. So, But if you choose the correct place to record your videos, it, it, you get like a natural feel to the actual videos and, and it gives you like the proper lighting on like your face or uh, like on the, on the um, object that you're filming. It's a really dull day today, really grey today. So it looks like it might rain actually, but it's a nice natural light, light lighting to the um, video, which is a nice thing to have instead of it being so bright from using the light or anything like that. If you get the lighting very equal, like to start off with, you can then in the, the software you can change it to how you prefer. Like so, say like so this side was really bright but you want it a bit more darker you can then do that in the um, software but also again on the same side but you can you can make it you can do it on the other side as well you can make it but that's how you can make it black and white or pop the color on specific parts if you don't have enough light you can then mix it in the uh, software you've got natural light at the moment and we're, and we're now gonna we're now gonna t show you what it like what it's like by adding the light on in the actual room, you can tell the difference between natural lighting and to actually having something that's on in the actual room, like a light bulb. I, at the moment, we're recording with the window to the side of me, so you get so you can actually see see what it's like. And, and we're now going to show you what it's like with the window behind. This is with no light, like no no light bulb on or anything, and me with the um, window behind me. So I imagine it's probably quite dark now, so it's not a great lighting. Whereas beforehand, it was probably more. The colours probably popped more. You probably could see a bit more. If we um, change the exposure so it's on me, it gets a little bit grainy, so it's a bit more fuzzy. So it's not not as well. It's not a nice video, and I don't think many people. people it's probably where people will probably click off your video because it looks like it's. No, 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 not a lot of good quality video to watch anymore. So you'll see this is where I do a lot of my um, videos in my in this room. And although it's really dull outside, you could probably you could probably see there's still quite good light here, even because I'm right by the window. And this is what it would be like if we had the light on. It actually flickers a bit, so you probably see that a little tiny bit if you if you can like. It's a, it's quite a cool light anyway. This one, but it's a bit, it's probably does it probably a little bit bright on my face now. I imagine yeah. this is um, the, you probably can see that the outside light is quite white, and the inside. I mean, I've got this light on. It's probably quite yellow, but we but we can change that in in the program. So if you do um, record in indoor light, you can still you can still, you can change you can adjust that in the program so it's a bit more of a natural look on the video itself. Well that's it everybody for this week's vlog. This is part of my um, November 30 day challenge. I hope you find this video useful. Please like, share, comment, subscribe and I'll see you next time. Cheers.